Come on. Start thinking about it. If you played football, you think about that big game that you were in. If you got a dream right now you're dreaming about, be thinking about it. I go back to pass for that first time, and there's guys coming at me. They're trying to kill me, and it's, it's, it's a blur. I mean, the receivers look like a blur. I can't see what's going on. I see this white streak, and that's what offense was. And I think he's open. I go to throw the ball, and out of nowhere, the black jersey, the free safety comes and picks off the ball. And I remember thinking, oh, my word, how can anybody ever complete a pass or know whether or not a receiver's open or not? And <clears throat> I think that's how a lot of people feel about financial planning and all the products that go around them. They're confused. What are they? Now, if you're not a football fan, hopefully tonight you'll come away understanding football a little bit better. <laughs> Those of you who are football fans know who this is. Ray Lewis, the just recently retired middle linebacker of the Baltimore Ravens. What is it about Ray Lewis? He's mean, he's nasty, he's controversial, and he's a leader. And that's a middle linebacker in football, and that's what Ray Lewis played, is typically the leader or the captain of the defense, kind of like the quarterback is of the offense. Smoker, and he's... <laughs> He's just smoking, so Cindy and I are sitting at the ta kitchen table, and he's over there just uh, smoking and stressed out. And his wife says, oh, he's stressed. He's thinking about it. Well, he comes back. He sits down. He says, Steve, I just can't commit to that. And I says, well, Rick, I didn't want to commit to my wife either, but sometimes you just got to do it. <laughs> now let's talk about offense. I would bet, I would dare guess that the most avid football fan here can't name all five starting offensive linemen for their favorite team. And if you can, I'll bet you can't name 15 starting NFL offensive linemen in the NFL. And why is that? Well, it's because they're not real glamorous, they're not real sexy, they're just, <laughs> right, they just big and, but they're very important to the team. But wide receivers can be exciting. We can throw and we can hit long bombs and, and score touchdowns. Now again, a stock is where we, we are able to buy a piece of a company. And there's a lot of well-established companies out there that we can buy stock, but there's a lot that aren't well-established. So the risk is, again, as I said, the further I get away from the football, the harder it is to get the ball to them, and the faster they, they are. With some of these companies that are maybe not as established, buying a stock can perhaps be a little risky. Incomplete pass, maybe I'm not getting any yards, or worse, it's interception and I lose money. So you just have to be careful when you're drafting of what kind of player that you, do you want. As I said, I played quarterback in high school. My coach said, Steve, you need to make things happen, especially when a play breaks down. Well, if you remember, the first time I went back to pass, it was a blur. <laughs> oh, I can still see it. It was a blur. But as time went on, as I practiced and I got to learn the offense and I knew where receivers were going to be, I would even walk down the halls at school. I called it field vision. I'd walk down the halls and I'd pick out a student down the hall and I'd say field vision, field vision. So as the other students were coming, I would focus on that person. Or as traffic, when there was a lot of traffic, whatever it was, I, I found myself saying, okay, field vision, this is the time to look and say, okay, this is, I got to focus on this even though there's all this other stuff coming at me. And over time, as I began to do that, the picture became a lot clearer. And so I asked you there, what is it you want to accomplish in life? Not only financially, but what do you want to accomplish professionally? What do you want to accomplish physically, mentally? What's your dream? What's your vision? Go out and get it. If you focus on it, you practice it, eventually it becomes clearer. And it makes and it happens. I felt like there was very informative, and it allows people that don't understand finances to definitely understand it a lot easier. And I, I enjoyed it. I'm really glad I came tonight. I actually learned quite a bit about football, 
but I'm really glad I came tonight. It it inspired me to want to learn more and to do more for me and my family. When you have someone come and speak at an event, you, they need to be knowledgeable in the industry. And I believe Steve is an expert and he takes his clients uh, interest to heart and uh, provides a great service to be able to give them what they need. I would recommend Steve Roberts to speak at my event because he was clear and precise and his presentation was well thought out, well planned and even for a girl it made me understand football and financial planning better.